Welcome to Buckwheat Farms Magic Emporium and Ballroom. It's been a few days uh, since we've uh, posted a video. That's due to some technical issues we've had. Uh, those same technical issues, they pushed back completion of the Sustainable Permaculture for Beginners Udemy course that I'm developing. Uh, I intend on finishing the course this weekend and I'll make it available on our website uh, at a discount. Keep an eye out for that. These technical issues, along with preparing material for the course, uh, those two things blended together perfectly with the topic of part three. We'll move from consumer to producer. If you missed part one, get your mind right, and or part two, as if, I suggest you go back right now, check those two videos out, they're not very long, they're short, but impactful. Now let's talk about moving from being a consumer to being a producer. The first step is to simply apply the principles from parts one and two to this issue. We are trained to be consumers almost from birth. Our education system, our market system, even the monetary system are all set up to funnel us to a consumer mentality. Whenever we feel the need and notice, I said feel, we seek to fill that need. We are led via the ads, social media, uh, even trendsetters, etc. to determine that the only way to fill that need is to get in a box drive to a box and buy something in a box or get it online. For many, the possibility of filling that need by any other means is completely alien. These systems, education, entertainment, and I include media and all political pandering in the latter, these systems drive us via constant rattling of fear-inducing chains. And their intent is to make us look at every other human as a competitor, vying with us for all the resources on the earth and these limited amount of resources. They drive and cajole us into operating from a lack mindset. They induce us with thoughts of, what if I miss out? This is the mind you have to change in order to transition from consumer to producer. Becoming a producer means far more than planting a garden or raising meat rabbits, even though both are highly recommended as a means of doing so. Becoming a producer means unplugging from the debt-based fiat currency system and plugging into a system that's based on voluntary interactions, exchanges that are unfettered by the sticky little fingers of the fear merchants in governments and bureaucracies. Every barter, every consumer exchange system or timeshare transaction pulls energy and attention away from the corporatist Marcus Cabal running the market. And this is the third step towards personal autonomy. I'll spend the next few videos detailing some specific actions one can take to unplug, but I'm sure you've already come up with several of your own. My challenge to you is in this next week to take one active step to remove yourself from the current paradigm and place yourself in the new perspective of an abundance mindset. Whether that means buying something produced locally, producing something yourself instead of uh, being a consumer, or simply using an alternative means of currency. See you next time.